You would think by now, after doing all these videos on YouTube, I would get the hang of all this stuff, but in, in the videos that I've done during the tent, I forgot to plug in the microphone. And this is actually the second time I'm recording this because the first time I had the settings. Oh my goodness. But what's going on everyone? My name is Sherwin and in this video, we will be doing the Model X tent. As mentioned before, this is the shop I always bring my cars to. I always recommend it to friends and family um, because they do a really good job and the price is fair. Miguel, the owner, I've known him for many years and uh, he's a great guy. So you could tell in this video, we're just having a lot of fun. So shout out to Leo, the tent technician for spending some time. He was very nervous. I caught him off guard. I'm like, hey man, um, can you do some behind the scenes commentary? So uh, I'm glad he, he was okay with it, but he was a, a little bit nervous in some parts of the video, but we had uh, a really good time. If you're wondering about what the 3M Crystalline technology is, I did a, another video previously when I took my Model Y Performance to get tint done, same shop, same tint. So check that out. Shout out to Miguel once again uh, for also taking the time to explain what that technology and how that tint works. That's on a different video. Uh, check the description below uh, for all the links and everything. Also down below, if you just wanna skip around in the video, uh, go ahead and do so with the timestamps. Now I've met a, a few more new friends online and one of them actually, uh, once they found me was like, hey, I had a hard time looking for you and I didn't want to uh, message you on YouTube. And she was on one of the Tesla Facebook groups and saw one of my comments and put two and two together. Like, I think this is the same Sherwin. So she reached out on Facebook Messenger and we started talking. Um, so if you guys are ever wondering like how to get a hold of me outside of YouTube, if you don't want to use the YouTube comments, I will put the um, links to all my other social media accounts. If you want to use those instead, I'm on Instagram, Twitter, uh, Facebook, Messenger and stuff. If you're going to reach out on Facebook, just set, uh, reach out on the Facebook Messenger and it's going to notify me. So go ahead and do that. And as long as I have time, I love uh, conversating with you guys out there. So th thank you for everyone that I've been chatting with, meeting new friends has been awesome. So if you like this video, please like the video. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. Um, there's bloopers at the end, so stay tuned for that. And I hope you enjoy the video. Thanks for watching. So right now we're just prepping the window for installation. So I already wiped it down and I'm going over with just my squeegee now and just getting all the water off making sure there's no contamination before we install it. All right, so just peeled it off. Since it's frameless, we're just gonna pull the whole sheet off and uh, we're gonna go over to the window and install it. Just spray a little water and then we'll carefully insert it and just to make sure not, nothing bunches up in here. I don't know if the camera catches it, but you can kind of see how the crystalline turns red. Then I'm gonna go with my gray card and insert it into the bottom molding. Try to get as close as we can to the edge right here. Okay. And then finalize it a little bit before we squeegee out the water because that's what makes it all stick. So once I look at all the edges and make sure everything's all lined up, all this extra will get filed off so it'll be fine. Just make sure that everything touches at the edge and for a good install. So here we're just gonna squeegee out the water.
All right, so we're gonna shrink the window from the outside. So prior to shrink down the outside, I like to give it a little clean because I don't want to bring any contamination onto the window. We'll insert our window. This one is right here. There we go. And the wet. So we shrink these windows just to make sure that there's no fingers when we get inside and it molds the the tent to the window. Tent doesn't go on on, on the outside, it goes on the inside. Just for everybody that, you know, is curious. And um, with the crystalline that, that Sherwin got, it's, uh, it's, it's a different way to shrink it. So we gotta shrink both sides. So the way to get in is gotta go under it, give it a little heat under. So you trap that heat in, and you kind of work your way up on it. And then, same process all around, just to make sure there's no fingers. There you go. And then that's when we have our shrink window, and then we'll go inside and uh, prep it, and then we'll peel the outer edges of this. I'll go ahead and peel this. Look for any of the miscut that the computer didn't cut. Everything looks fine, so we'll just go inside and prep it. So since these windows tilt up, it's easier just to go inside and prep these windows because then you'll be looking up to the sky the whole time. So we'll just get a little run down here. So when we insert these ones on the Model X, it's, it's, it goes as similar as to inserting on any regular car. It's just we go insert on the inside just because, I mean, if you could tell by this, you'll be up like this and the film comes back down on you. So I'll just typically insert one side then insert the other and I'll match up my lines at the top to the, top, to the edge of the glass so I can run my finger through and it's good. Then from there I'll just start squeegeeing out the water. All right, y'all, I'm here with Leo. You've seen him in the other videos. This is the man, the technician, doing all the tinting. Mm -hmm. This guy's got skills. Yep. Whenever you come here, 
This is the guy that's doing your cars. All right, so so Leo did 50% in the back and then 40% in the front, the front yeah. right? Give it and a um, we didn't do anything on the roof. I didn't really want to do anything on the roof, on the Falcon doors. I didn't want to do anything on the Falcon door roof. Um, I, I wanted to keep it as close to stock as possible. That's why we went with um, crystalline. Crystalline, yeah. Crystalline yeah. It keeps that that uh, heat out. So we, we, as light as you go, it still keeps that heat out. Like same heat same, rejection. Same, same heat rejection all around. Yeah. yeah. So you're you're getting. See, if you went standard, you wouldn't get that heat rejection. It'd be just like plain on there because they don't even make rolls that light for standard film. Just okay. the crystalline. Crystalline stops at 20 because of the heat rejection. So okay. So yeah, so um, Leo was helping me uh, with the video. He was doing behind the scenes stuff. So hopefully y'all learned something because I did. And he was explaining things as he goes. So thank you very much, Leo. Of course, of course, anytime. Thank you, Miguel. Miguel is over there. Uh, oh, he's coming this way. Let's go, Miguel. Get in here, Miguel. Get in here. The man, the myth. My, my, the my friend, my friend Miguel right here. <laughs> Oh, right, yeah. always taking care of me always taking care of me so this time is the model x um so i'll probably see you maybe in a few weeks for the model y my windshield right um do the same treatment just for the windshield so if you're in the area come check this dude out it's not a sponsored video but he does really good work the prices is just fair so check him out call him up give him a call all right miguel thank right. you very much thank you again Thank you for watching. If you liked the video, please like. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. And I'll see you on the next one. So, Leo, we did, um, what did we do? Like a... We did uh, 50 on the front, two, uh, driver and passenger. And then we did 40 in the back window. No, the other way. No. Nah. We did 50 in the back. Isn't it the lighter color? Oh, you're right. You're right. You're right. <laughs> All right, we're going. So, so we did... <laughs> 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 so, all right. I messed up, all right.